Shares in the business, Fortress Fund Managers continues to do well. That's according to investment director with Fortress, Roger Cave, who made the comment as Fortress recently hosted its seventh annual investment forum at the Frank Cullimo Hall. Business continues to grow despite the removal of the various tax incentives. A particular interest is the area of pensions, which has now exceeded 250 million in assets. And the property fund we don't cover at this event because it's a separately listed uh, entity and has its own AGM. But we have some good plans for that and a new person joining that team and so you'll hear more about, about that fund. Mr. Cave also gave an update on investors' returns from specific funds. After coming before you for several years with nothing nice to say, I'm delighted and proud to say that, that the Caribbean Growth Fund has produced 9.8% for the year ended September 30th, 2016. The, so, we at last made some money for you. Um, the high interest fund did well as just under 4%, and as you can see, the pension funds with solid returns along close on the long term averages. Well, disciplinary action can now be taken against accountants who are members of the Institute of Chartered Accountants of Barbados if complaints against them are well founded. And this from Executive Director Reginald Farley as he was speaking to members of the media. Mr. Farley explains the public should be made aware that any complaints can now be handled carefully through the disciplinary board. So our new disciplinary, disciplinary regulations set out quite clearly the type of offences that can be clearly committed and the type of penalties that could be imposed. Um, there's also a quite easy to complete form where if a member of the public um, had a problem in, uh, with a member and wanted to raise a complaint, then there is a, a prescribed form. The regulations set out where it should go, the time frames within which action uh, has to be taken. Uh, the member can also indicate, or the complainant can indicate what type of um, redress. And the president of ICAB, Lisa Padmore, is urging the public to be selective who they do business with, stating that ICAB members have a greater level of credibility and are held in high regard. ICAB's list of its qualified accountants who are members of ICAB are, is listed on our website. It is refreshed regularly and so therefore um, I will acknowledge at this point that there are persons in Barbados who are practicing in this profession who are not members of ICAB and as such we have no um, power or jurisdiction over those persons. So it is in the interests of the public to um, purchase their services from those who are members of ICAB as they are protected under the regulations of ICAB and the Act. Well, here's a look now at how the stocks traded on selected exchanges across the region. In Jamaica, Sajikor Group Jamaica Limited was the volume leader with 3,344,598 units, followed by Supreme Ventures Limited and the Jamaica Stock Exchange. In Trinidad, Guardian Holdings Limited was the volume leader with 1,175,542 shares valued at $14,710,884.04 followed by National Commercial Bank Jamaica Limited and JMMB Group Limited. And in Barbados, Fortress Caribbean Property